on guys, welcome back to NBA 2K18 today. We got two new gameplays coming for you and let me just say, my team, whatever you're doing over there, you're just feeling all great. I mean, keep it up. You guys are killing it with the content right now. We're getting tons of news. Well, not tons of news, but little bits of news about 2K19. Things are going great right now. Great momentum, good snowballing that we're going here with 2K right now. I think now that the 2K League is up and running and underway, they can finally get back to the forgotten ones, which is us, and start really get things going here and prep for 2K19. But we got two new gameplays as mentioned. First up, 97 overall, Steph Curry, 9 three-pointers in game two. Was it game two? Game two. And uh, he gets a new card. 97, 6, 3, 96, 99. He's got 14 Hall of Fame badges. One man fast break, pick and roll maestro, classy passer, ankle breaker, relentless finisher, teardropper, acrobat, catch and shoot, tireless scorer, difficult shots, corner specialist, mid-range Jedi, deep-range Jedi, limitless range, along with five other little gold badges there. What do we got here on Chef Curry? Now, this one did have a shoe on it. 98. For a layup, he's got 98 drop foul, 99 mid-range. And he's got, of course, 99s for three ball. Unbelievable. He's got 96 passing accuracy. He's got 92 lateral quickness block. Uh, I don't know why I'm mentioning that. 97 shot contest, 97 steal. His defense is actually pretty dang good for a Chef Curry card. I'm not going to lie. Obviously, no dunking there, but plenty of speed. And he's got a 98 offensive consistency. Probably you guys are wondering why I am running him at the two. Because this year is a different year. You can't really run cards like this at the one. I could, but he's going to run into LeBron's and Giannis's and T-Max. And that's just not fair for Lil Chef Curry. Now, is it? Now, we got a new card that came out today. And look at the face on that. That has got to be one of the ugliest card arts. They've been usually killing it with card arts. But they did my man Iggy dirty with that face. You tell me what that looks like in the comments. Leave it. Go ahead and leave it in the comments. Defensive overall, 99 Defensive overall, 93 offensive overall, and uh, he's got six Hall of Fame badges. Hey, would you look at that? 95 overall is not as many Hall of Fame badges as our pink diamond that we just got. Imagine that. Chase Down Artist, pick and pocket. Uh, did pick Dodger, charge guard, defensive stopper, posterizer, along with 14 other very nice gold badges, as you can see there. No limitless range. 94 layup, and uh, for the layups, he's got 88 dropout, which I feel like Iggy gets to the line more than that, but whatever. Um... He's got, you know, his shooting is okay, 87, 93 ball is good enough, free throw of an 85 is very generous, seeing he's not very good at the line, 90 ball control, could probably be pretty good at point guard, uh, he's got 98 pass perception, uh, it's 97 steal, 98 shot contest, his lockdown defense, as you can tell, he's got very good dunking, 97 driving dunk, 95 contact dunk, 100 dunk content, and see, of course, with the posterizer, pretty decent in the speed category, vertical, very good, strength, decent, Offensive consistency of a 95. We got two Warrior Brothers keeping it alive in the finals and uh, on their way to another trophy. I can't say so myself. Can they take on the title champions of the Super Sweat preseason before another round begins or season begins? Well, it's only one way to find out. Let's get some gameplay. All right, it looks like we found an opponent. Let's see who my Warrior Brothers are going up against. Who do we got? Dill Bickle, Pink Diamond League, very, very good. He's got Lonzo Ball, Kobe Bryant, LeBron James, Chris Stapps, Porzingis, Pink Diamond, and Foul Gasol. Well, well, well. Look at this little sweat nugget that we found in preseason. Should be interesting. Here we go. Now, I do know this opponent. It is going to be a really rough match, so I hope we can get the gameplay that we're looking for. But, guys, like I said, this is trying to show you authentic gameplay is what they're going to play like out there on the court. We'll see if these guys are worth your team. But let's go. He's got a nice little custom court made here. I like it. Oh, don't leave Chef Curry. What are you doing? That is your first mistake, sir. Flash over to Larry Bird looking out to Curry. Curry coming around, getting in there. Curry, nice little layup. Oh, baby. Spackety mackety. Okay, good steal. We get, he gets one. We get one right back. We might try moving three. Curry, flash. Chef Curry with the shot, boy. Curry taking on LeBron just like he does in the finals. Well, he has a little bit in the finals. Oh, my God. Curry just took the king down. Throw it right into Iggy. Iggy is going to bomb this puppy down. Oh, we find a lane immediately. Iggy, oh, what was that? Back to Iggy. Iggy bringing it around. Kobe, he's getting in there. Good foul. Even though he doesn't have a great drop foul, he connected on that one. Free throw looks easy. Al Gasol becomes the ultimate rebounder over Akeem Olajuwon. Oh, Iggy through the lane. There we go. Easy little girl steppy. 
play that I love so much running for my shooting guards right over to the Iggy. Or not, we'll just go to the line. Get easy points that way. Let me see if we got something here. Eight, seven, six. All right, hold it there. Wait for Iggy. Wait for Iggy. There it is. Iggy. Ooh, that was a terrible shot. And he still caught it. Oh, my God. Start off the second quarter. We're going to leave Iggy in just a little bit. Then we'll bring back in Chef Curry, man. By Iggy there, grabbing those rebounds. That's what he can do with that vertical. Can we take it all the way? Oh, baby, look at the extension. Just real quick to see if we can do anything here. Oh, we get another easy one. Out to Iggy. Easy release. I love his release. Bad angle. Freaking open looks. It's really starting to piss me off. Oh, Iggy with the lane. Iggy with the layup. God, layup package. I thought you had posterizer. LeBron coming in strong. Let's show. <laughs> oh, man. When the king wants a bucket, he'll get a bucket. Man, they're killing me. Oh, but we got a line drive with the king. And he blew it. Unbelievable. But Mellow, fatty. Yes, sir. Pick up the crumbs. You love those. Away from us. I just can't stop this guy's offense. And I keep throwing it into him. So we're going down looking good. Where's Curry going all the way? Oh, man, they're so Perfect. worried about Chef. They're so worried about Chef. I'm even going to lie. I feel like my players are moving like snails. Bird, could you get out of the freaking way? Go his way is absolutely unbelievable. Get in there, Giannis. Can you show some authority, please? Oh, my God. Come on, man. This guy is getting every break. All right, good rebound there. I'm going to throw it up to Kurt. I just can't even make a pass right now. He's getting it to fall in right now. That's the kind of game we're having right now. Giannis is going to have to take charge, man. We got to get something going. Update at halftime. Chef Curry, kind of a slower second quarter. 12 points, 5 of 6, 2 of 2. Shooting phenomenal. And then Andre Iguodal, 11 points, 1 rebound, 1 and 2, 4 of 6. They're both shooting pretty good. We've just fallen behind and have kind of lost our way into the gameplay, but... We'll see if we can pick back up, see if we can break down this lead, see if we pull out this W. I start off the third quarter, we're going to leave the starters in, we need them man, we got to get a run going. Cause there is... <laughs> it's over, he has made it all, where are we going, throw it back over, oh screen the ball man, that's what we need, good ball movement, we'll equal green beans, we need, where are we looking, back over to Kevin Durant, Kevin Durant coming around, he's leaving Curry open, you can't leave him for a second baby. Run it up. Let's run it up. Curry going all the way. He's got a line drive here. We'll get in there. Chef Curry, man, making moves. Good steal there by Giannis. And here we go, baby. Bring that run. Fast shots, man, but that's okay. We'll bring it around. Giannis is going to get in there and show him why. It was worth locking in the set. The runner. Iggy on the runner. Finds a way at pass. Getting in there. Another drop foul. Iggy. The freaking tricky. That doesn't work. Up to King James. King James. Oh, don't give the... You give King James the aisle, you better just bow down. Back into Iggy. Iggy, get in there. Push your way through. Hammer time. Six. God, take long enough. Throw it back over to Iggy. Iggy for three. That's an easy release. Iggy. Finally. God, plays broken much. Oh, start of the fourth quarter. We're going to leave Iggy in. Make sure Curry gets a nice encore. And real cherry would be pulling out this victory. Go, let's go. I'm going to run it down with King. I'm gonna run it down with King. Yeah, Gary West. Try guard royalty. Can't happen. Freaking looking for. Looking over to Paul George. Paul George. What the f weak, Paul George. You're a posterizer. Dalek, because he's got a little lane there. Where are we looking over to LeBron James? Getting a clear lane, and that's all he needs. It's just a little bit of room. King, I see a fat and mellow for a dimer special. Baby, let's go. It works. God damn, man. Oh, there we go. Easy bucket around. Iguodala wide open. Green bean, baby. That's not a green bean. You were wide open. Oh, God. And a nice little funk there. Iggy had to miss that wide open three, and it throws our whole chemistry out. Perfect. Let's get that to Paul George. Green bean. We get it right back. It's not the lineup that it was supposed to be. Oh, my God. No, no, no. I put in the tall lineup. Oh, Curry. Doesn't matter. Over to Sean Bradley. Sean Bradley, why are you in? Doesn't matter. I'm glad you're here. Iggy, Iggy got a wide lane. Where are we looking? Back over to Giannis. Giannis wide open in the corner. Giannis! Some of the bull crap that's happened. I've missed some wide open shots, man. Wide open shots. Chef Curry gets a wide open lane and blackity mackity, man. We just got to make sure we try and get a stop. Giannis going all the way around. Ooh, Mello getting a stop there. Get out of the way, little Mello. You're too small for the Greek glitch. It's on a foul, bro. God! Throwing it up to Curry. Curry's got the lane. Curry, where are we looking? Back over to Porzingis. Porzingis, why'd you have to be in that weird response? Get in there, Durant! Durant! 
man, how did you miss the dunk, bro? Oh my god, you get the steal. Chef Curry, oh, no one can hold the steal. And that's going to be game right there because Durant misses a dunk and we get the steal and he still gets the ball back. Oh, Curry, back over to Durant. Durant stopped and popped and is that the shot? We'll get something, but... I don't think that's going to be enough. All right, guys, that is going to be the game. Shout out to my opponent, man. Good thing this is Supermax, or else I would be absolutely furious. You saw what happened. We missed a wide-open corner with Giannis to start the momentum change. We miss a dunk with Durant, and then we get a steal with Curry stripping James, and we don't get the recovery. Just It's just small things like that, and that, that'll cost you three points, and uh, that'll ultimately cost you the game. But... Luckily, Iguodala, Steph Curry still stuff the stats. Check them out. It's checking out the stats. Steph Curry, 19 points, 3 assists, 8 and 9, 3 and 3. Shoot damn phenomenal. I mean, guys, this card right here is perfect for a shooting guard. Just does everything you need him to do. And with the defense now, he's definitely not a liability anymore. Now, let's talk price. I did pick him up for about one. Uh, I want to say 150. I definitely think he's worth in the hundreds with all the badges that he comes with, but you'll probably see him drop pretty quickly. Um, I definitely don't think this is the last Curry we're going to see either. I definitely see a pink diamond coming, maybe a 98 overall as well. So I don't invest too much into it. I've tried to spend no more than 100k tops. I think he'll get there within the next couple days or so. Um, definitely a very good card. On a 1 to 10, I'm going to give it a 9.5, obviously, because of the size. Now, defense is good, not great yet. It's pretty good. It's almost great, but just not quite there yet. So we'll give him a 9.5. And, and then the Iku Dala, very, very nice role player. Um, I wouldn't spend over 100k for this card. 95, spending over 100k is kind of an L. I would spend somewhere in the 80s to 70ks for this card, but very, very good um only real con is that doesn't have amazing shooting that's good shooting with the 93 ball i mean that'll get it done for sure i mean you don't need to add a shoe but probably would want to add the shoe so we'll make it more than miss it and then uh yeah i definitely a great lockdown defender he could run really one through three in my opinion so on the eager dog i am going to give him also uh, i'm probably giving him a nine and a half as well just because the shooting is good not great I mean, the 93 ball, like I said, that's a great three ball. Don't get me wrong. He'll make more than he'll miss of those. But eh, I'm going to say in the above 93s is where we want to get to elite status. But he's not really known for drilling them like that anyway. So nine and a halfs on both cards. And uh, just a rough loss today. Rough loss today. But uh, I did want to address a couple things. One, 2K19 came out with some very big news today um, about the pre-order bonus. It looks great. 50K. You get some packs. You get a Sapphire LeBron. I'm sure you'll also get that whatever Sapphire card they throw in for the regular cover art. So it looks like to be a good promo. Very, very excited about that. Also, Ronnie said in the stream today when he was playing Supermax that locker codes are coming. Not this week, but next week. So we got to pay attention to that. He also said another big day of my team is coming. We'll look forward to that. Also, round another season starting tonight. So that'll be very fun, very exciting. Can't wait to see who the Pink Diamond is. I'm hoping for Ben Simmons, Anthony Davis, or like Donovan Mitchell, somewhere around that nature. A current player that we can all enjoy and want to get. And last thing, I was recently banned on Twitch for a month. Um, I'm trying to get that lowered. I said some things that probably were a little inappropriate, definitely inappropriate for YouTube, so I won't go over exactly what I said, but it was an F word, and it was not F-U-C-K. You can probably do the rest of that, but guys, hopefully you enjoyed the gameplay. I want to apologize for my language. I got caught in a moment, and it's not something I usually do. You guys see my videos, and you know, I can be crude sometimes, but that's usually not my nature, and definitely was not my intent at all. So I definitely wanted to apologize for that, but yeah, until further notice, you won't see me on Twitch, and because of my contract with Twitch, I don't think I can actually stream on YouTube either, but hopefully you guys do forgive me for that. You know, we all have weak moments, mistakes, that's how we learn, that's how we build, that's how we get stronger. But guys, hopefully you enjoyed these gameplays, both very good cards, you can decide if you want them for this next season of Supermax, I'm out of here. Hopefully you enjoyed it, we got a lot of new cards out, came out today, a Wilt, we got, uh... Wilt's the only one really coming to mind right now. So if you guys want to see Wilt, we'll do that. And then, hey, maybe something more comes out tomorrow. But until then, Richie Nation, hit the subscribe button if you're new. And party on.